In question 6 of this exercise, we have to complete the congruence statements for each of these two figures. So in the first figure, we see that the statement is triangle BCA is congruent to what triangle? And in, for the second figure, we have the statement triangle QRS is congruent to what triangle? Okay, so let's observe the first figure. Triangle BCA is congruent to what triangle? So triangle BCA, let me highlight this triangle for you. Triangle BCA is this triangle and clearly you can see that this is congruent to uh, this triangle uh, the upper the, the triangle above uh, the segment BA and how do we match the order of the vertices well the vertex B in triangle BCA will correspond to the vertex B itself in triangle BTA uh, because this angle here and this angle here they are equal okay so uh, we can write so let's complete it uh, let's complete the congruence relation by writing the vertices one by one so triangle BCA now corresponding to B we write B for the second triangle then corresponding to C this vertex here uh, we see that this is this angle angle BCA is equal to angle BTA so for corresponding to C we will write T and then finally corresponding to A in triangle BCA we will have A itself in triangle BTA as well okay so corresponding to A we will have A so triangle BCA will be congruent to triangle BTA this is how you can complete the first congruence relation now let's come to the second one in the second one we have to complete triangle QRS is congruent to what triangle so once again let's start by highlighting triangle QRS so Q R S okay this is the triangle and clearly this triangle is congruent to this triangle for some order of the vertices we have to figure out the correct order of the vertices so we write triangle Q R S and then we will match the vertices one by one so corresponding to Q this angle here we will have T this angle here okay so let me use a different color corresponding to Q we have T in the second triangle so we write the first vertex as T then corresponding to R in the first triangle in triangle QRS this vertex here we have the vertex P in the second triangle so we write P and then we write the third vertex which is Q so triangle QRS is congruent to triangle TPQ and this is how you can complete the second congruence relation and with this we have completed question number six to learn more about how qmath can help you crack school and board exams explore qmath leap a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers